Hi guys, it's Lilamar from Bell and the Bulldogs. And I'm Jaheem from 100 Things to Do Before High School. And this is How, how to Make, make Gingerbread, gingerbread tarts. Cookies. Oh. They're tarts. They're, co they're oh, not they're tarts. cookies, they're, they're tarts, tarts actually. We asked you for some cool rockin' Christmas ideas and recipes, and you guys gave us some cool gingerbread tarts recipe. Specifically, we had someone named Angelique help us out. She is here with us today. Say hello. Angelique! <laughs> Just putting it out there, she is a YouTuber if you want to go check out her YouTube channel. I'm Loki, like a big fan. I love her problem cover. Thank you. So now we got her here, we got our ingredients. First, we have a three quarter cup of brown sugar. One stick of butter, softened. Two large eggs. One quarter cup of molasses. Three and three quarter cups of flour. Two and a half teaspoons of ginger. One and a half teaspoons of baking, baking soda. soda. We got baking, baking soda, soda guys. <laughs> One teaspoon of cinnamon. One half teaspoon of nutmeg. One half teaspoon of allspice. And one half teaspoon of salt. And for our filling, we have two cups of chocolate hazelnut spread. One and a half cups of mascarpone cheese. Just buy it, don't try to say it. Another quarter teaspoon of salt. And finally we have whipped cream and sprinkles and other fun stuff to decorate up our little tart. Gin gingerbread tarts. Gingerbread tarts, hey! So Angelique, what inspired you to do this recipe? Well, um, my mom, she really likes to cook and I sort of like, you know, I hang out with her when she's cooking, and yeah. <laughs> First, we are going to start with our dry ingredients. Yeah. This is ginger, right? Uh -huh. This is ginger. All right. Uh -huh. And go. Now we go for the bacon soda. We got bacon, bacon soda. soda. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Cinnamon. 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 Nutmeg. Ooh. Next up, we are going to put in our allspice. Ooh. Ooh. Now we're gonna put in our salt. <laughs> so yeah, we put them all in. Now we're gonna mix it all together. Whoa. Let's mix it up. Maybe set out like a tablecloth or like paper towels if you don't ah. want to make a mess in your kitchen like she just did. See what you've done? <laughs> all right, now that we have mixed all our dry ingredients, we are going to put in our wet ingredients. I think that's what they're called. They're just dry other ingredients. Just yes, brown sugar. You're gonna have to. You're gonna have to come here. Butt. Come on, don't be shy. Don't abuse it. There. <laughs> <laughs> literally just in the shape of the ball. Like, I just came out to have a good time and I'm literally, literally feeling so much right right now. Right now. butter in there. Yes, okay. So now we're gonna mix it together. <laughs> Next step is the eggs. Ready, one, two, two three. three. Yes, oh my god. And mix it all together now, yes. Molasses. Next we're gonna put our dry ingredients into our wet ingredients. Now make sure to put these little by little so it doesn't get too sticky and mushy and stuff. We're gonna use the whisk. Whip it. Yes! yes! You gotta hit the whip, hey. Eh. <laughs> oh dude, it automatically looks different. Now that we mixed it up a little bit, we're gonna put more. <laughs> it's becoming like really like, like thick. Look at us being creative. We didn't use frozen cookies. <laughs> Oh, our gifts fell. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait, can I just? Angelique, I have a present for you. Yes! <laughs> you don't get oh, dear. that. This is a time where you put your hands in, okay? They're no longer on fleek. I'm sure you're. They're no longer on fleek. Your nail doer will be. Wait, what's what's it? What do they call it? My nail doer? Come on! Oh my God. I worked so hard to make it perfect. Just keep it. mushing. So now we're gonna wrap up our dough that we just made and it looks like clay. Um, and we're gonna put it up in this plastic wrap, wrap it up and then put it in the refrigerator for about an hour. Okay guys, so we have our dough over here which you know we just got out of the refrigerator. Look how cute they are, they're like little patties. We're gonna put some flour, spread it out all over the board and get ready to roll. I don't have one. I know. Oh, we're sharing it. Yeah. You ready? It's teamwork. Oh. Oh wow. Mine's just rolling around in the <laughs> Oh, that's so cool. Angelique, why do we use this little spray thingy? It's for the dough to not stick on the pan, mini thing. Basically what we're gonna do now is we're going to put this dough in little tart framing bowl things. 
Once you form your gingerbread cookie dough into crust, you are going to put it into the oven, but you will need adult supervision. But for now, since we're all kids here, we're just gonna use movie, movie magic, magic to make them appear. One, One two, two, three. three. Ginger boom! Wow, look at that. Oh, it's magical. Wow. And delicious looking. We're ready to make the filling. Wow. This is slower than molasses. <laughs> Actually. Yes. I'm a little salty right now. We. I think we mashed it up really good and it's all mixed up and it smells great. And now, we're gonna put it on our little top. So once you're finished putting all the filling on your little tarts, you're gonna put these back into the refrigerator for another hour. All right, so these are chilled tarts and we are ready to decorate them. Decorate, decorate, decorate. So Angelique, I'm gonna tell you all our cool little options that we have for the sprinkles. We have normal chocolate sprinkles, green sprinkles that remind me of Emerald City, colorful sprinkles, colorful stars, little tiny colorful beads of sparkles. And of course, there's the red little sparkling ones. Okay, Angelique, so which one is your favorite? What you want? The colorful stars! Yes! Okay. Fantastic. Oh. Oh. And here we go. We'll just... Look, it's so cute! Behold! Yay! Angelique, thank you so much for coming on the show and thank you for this awesome recipe. If you guys want to check out her YouTube channel, please do, it's pretty awesome. Especially her problem cover by Ariana Grande. I love it. It's a favorite. It's so good. And you want to sign us out with a little song? Nick, 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 Nickelodeon. Yay! Yay!